Yo guys, what is up? Welcome to another episode of Pokemon Revolution Online. You might be wondering, why am I doing it in the Viridian Forest once again? But there's actually a good thing here. Um, I finally looked it up online on how to get Headbutt in Pokemon Revolution Online. And apparently, it's inside this dark tree. Um, it's somewhere around over this way. I don't really know where to go. I think it's somewhere over here. Um, we'll see. We'll find it. Ooh, I found some berries. Grape berries and some qualop berries. Dude, we're finding berries up in this place. Oh, I found somebody. Erica. Would you like to teach me your Pokemon Giga Drain for 7,500? Bruh. Uh, yeah. Which Pokemon should I teach? Uh, Badu can learn Giga Drain. Um, and this would make Badu a uh, OP. Um, so Mega Drain, Growth. I want to keep Growth for sure. Stun Spore for sure. Um, I think I'm getting rid of Water Sport. Mega Drain, I want to. I don't want to just have Giga Drain, um, because it can only be used 10 times. So we might need more than 10. So I'll leave, I'll leave Water Sport for now and keep Mega Drain so that we have more moves. But now, um, no, I'm here to fight. I'm not here to fight. I'm just looking around. All right, so let's just go around and do Budu now has Giga Drain. Mega Drain can be used 15 times, so that gives us more moves to attack with. Um, and dude. We're going to destroy Misty now. I didn't even realize that. That's crazy we found that. That's OP, dude. Hey, more berries. A tomato berry. Nine of them. That's crazy. And a bunch of Pomac berries as well. Um, yeah, glad to see a lot of berries around here. Okay, somehow I made it back to the beginning. I have no idea. Oh, there's some berries at the very beginning as well. Um, somehow we need to find ourselves the... I don't, I don't have no idea. Do I have to watch the video again? Just step by step to figure out how he found the headbutt person. Oh, I found it. It was just in the same place as the Team Rocket person. Uh, I just hit this forest. Bugs all over the place. All right, so headbutt for 2,000. Yep. Okay, we'll go ahead and teach that to Rat. Um, yep. Let's see. We're going to forget Tail Whip for this one. Okay. okay. There we go. There we go. Now let's use a uh, escape rope, and this will take us to the Pokemon Center in uh, Pewter. All right, so um, that should complete the next task for uh, Officer Jenny. Why can I go in the thing here? There we go. The map was like lagging for some reason, but we do have headbutt now on Rattata, so um, I think Officer Jenny should we should complete our uh, thing here. So teach. Okay. Impressive. Here's your reward as promised. Five thousand Poké Dollars. G Z. Thank you, Officer Jenny. Um, I guess we can now move on from Pewter City. I think we've uncovered most of the secrets uh, up to this point. So um, I guess can we get running shoes? Is that a thing in this game? Or do we wait for the mounts. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna talk to this guy again because I talked to him before. Before I defeated Brock, I'm gonna talk to him after. Hey, you must be amazing. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Let's continue on our journey. Ooh, an Abra, dude. We already scanned an Abra. Okay, become a champion. This literally says the same thing as the other Pokemon. All right, so I'm gonna put my uh, rat in the front for now. Oh, we didn't even test out. We'll test it out on that tree down there as soon as we get down there. We gotta defeat last Janus first, and then we can try to headbutt a tree and see what happens. All right, trainer is defeated. Let's try to headbutt a tree, I guess. Okay. Uh, I think if they have this little symbol, it means we can headbutt them. Let's see. Uh, okay, so it was actually empty. So sometimes they can be empty. Um, let's scan this sand tree really quick. I guess we already scanned that before. Some sand slashes. Let's scan those Pokemons. Lash, lash. Okay. Um, I guess this is the meteorite you can use to change Deoxys in the future. But let's continue. Um, there's a few trees, I guess. we got to find the trees. All right, let's just feed all these trainers on this route, and then we'll look for trees to take on to, to just do whatever. Hey, Hopper Fang's a pretty good move. Um, I'm thinking about deleting Bot now. Um, quick Attack's just a good priority move to have. Um, but this is so much power, dude. How much power does Headbutt have? Uh, I don't know. Um, how much power? We can check here, I guess. Headbutt has 70 power, so we need Headbutt to, to do whatever we're doing. Um, we'll delete Bite. We can always relearn bite or whatever, but let's just go on with the things. Uh, the rest of the trainers here. Hey, Charmander wants to learn Dragon Rage, which might not be a bad move. Um, we're gonna get rid of Scratch for this one. Um, and no, we're not going to evolve our Charmander yet because um, apparently the XP rates get insane when you evolve Pokemon. So let's go ahead and see if we can headbutt a tree. Uh, while Pokemon attacks, let's see what kind of Pokemon. Oh, Silcoon. That's pretty cool. So it looks like like random Pokemon can just come out of the thing or whatever. Um, I guess this would be a good way for the decks. I have no idea. All right, we're just gonna kill these Pokemon for now. Cause I don't, I don't know. I don't really want to catch Pokemon at the moment. Um, I'll regret this in the future. But yeah, it's whatever. 
Now, if I found like a Heracross or Scyther from headbutting a tree, that'd be sick. I would definitely keep that Pokemon for sure. I know all Pokemon attacks, and it's a Kakuna, so yeah, it looks like it's mostly Kakunas and stuff. We're going to keep headbutting all the trees. It's probably the best thing to do. So I really don't know what else to do. This is another, there's another we got the Feebass head up there. I didn't realize that. Dude, what's up with these Feebass head guys? Ooh, level 17 now. So uh, we're going to continue to be leveling up and stuff, and that's going to suck because every time we say no to evolve, and there's another dude up there, the the whatever dude. All right. Um, there's a lot of Pokemon to scan. Let's continue exploring the route. I'll just keep defeating all these trainers. I know you guys don't like watching all these battles and stuff because it does get boring. So I'll just talk to you guys whenever I've defeated every single person on every route. Hey, another wild Pokemon. Um, yeah, we'll just run away from this one because Budu is not very good against bug types. There's some Clefairies and a Clefable down there. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, it looks like we made it to the end of the route. We defeated all the trainers and stuff. Um, I'm going to go ahead and heal up really quick before we do anything else. And there's a lot of people to talk to. Uh -huh. And, dude, the Magikarp Salesman, dude. I really do want a really good Gyarados in this game, and I think maybe he can give us... I don't know. I wonder if it's, like, guaranteed. Um, the most powerful Pokemon in existence for 2500. I'll give you a shiny one. Maybe if I'm benevolent mood, I'll give you a shiny one. Yes, please. All right, so we got a Magikarp. Okay. Oh, Magikarp learned Dragon Rage? Dude. I'll have another one to sell in a week, but I have other clientele to attend for now. I wonder if there's like a higher chance of getting a shiny Magikarp with that dude. Um, we got a regular Jolly Nature, dude. That's what you want. Oh, but non attack and 25 speed. Pretty decent. Um, I don't know if I really want this Magikarp. Could be good, though. Could be good. But with Dragon Rage, um, it could literally destroy like any Pokemon right now. Um, but let's just uh, continue on. There's a lot of people around here to talk to. We can talk to Fernando. Um, I'm relive the re. I don't know how to pronounce. Okay. All right, whatever. Oh, he's got a Rhyhorn, dude. I'm gonna scan your Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn. Okay, we got a girl here. Alex Pro Rocky Pokemon Geo, dude. We got youngster Cilio. Cilio. Oh, wow, it's a Boulder badge. You got it from Brock. Brock's cool. Okay. Here's a Clefairy. We can scan this Clefairy. Okay, well, I guess we can't scan that one because it can just talk to us. Pokestop. Welcome to Mount Moon. Mount Moon's only from one of the few places. Okay. Whatever. You do not have enough badges required to get items. We still don't have enough badges, dude. This is like a... It's a bypass. Okay. Um, there's still a few more places to explore around here, it looks like. Uh, how do we get up on top of the cave over here? How do we get up there? That's what I want to know. I want to know how to get up there. Oh, Ned here. What's he going to say? If it wasn't for my abundance of escape ropes, I would have navigated my way out of the cave. Oftentimes, okay, whatever. It's a good thing we have escape ropes. I'll sell for five for $2,000. Um, no, thank you. No, thank you. We have enough escape ropes right now. That guy can bulk sell us escape ropes maybe for a discounted price. I don't even know if they're discounted. Um, but I got a plan. Before we do anything, we're going to check all these headbutt trees and see if we can find ourselves like a hair across something. So that's the kind of Pokemon that I want on my team. All right, guys, that's going to be it for today's episode. It's uh, This was a shorter one, but I don't have much more time to record. I've been recording bulk videos, so hopefully you guys appreciate that. If you liked today's video, guys, leave a like in today's video. As always, I will see you all in the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching.